Dearly beloved, loving greetings in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ loves you a lot. That is why he speaks with you daily and encourages you. If the Lord loves me, I don't know why I am unable to feel the presence of the Lord God when I pray. I am unable to hear the sound of his voice. I don't know why the Lord is angry with me. Are you in such a situation today? Has the Lord forsaken me? Has the Lord forgotten me? These days it doesn't seem like the Lord listens to me. I am unable to feel his holy presence at all. Are you thinking like this? The Lord says in Isaiah chapter 54 verse 8 With a little wrath I hid my face from you for a moment. But with everlasting kindness I will have mercy on you, says the Lord. Sometimes he will become sorrowful. Some of our actions will cause his heart to grieve. He will feel sorrowful. If we cause him sorrow, isn't it a sad thing to us also? Sometimes he will get angry. The Lord will see and speak with anger. He will turn his face saying, don't speak with me. His face will be hidden from us. He says, with a little wrath, I hid my face from you for a moment. That is why when you pray, you are unable to feel the Lord's presence. Aren't you worried whether he hears and if he will answer, he might be angry. Find out what it is. All you need to do is confess it to the Lord God. Just say, dear Lord, forgive me if I have done, spoken or behaved in a manner that angered you. He is never a God who permanently turn his face in anger. He says, I hid my face from you just for a moment. Close your eyes and open it, that's all. He says, but with everlasting kindness, I will have mercy on you. That is his nature, good and merciful father. So even now he is eager to speak with you. Have you become discouraged? Begin to speak with the Lord immediately. Dear Lord, forgive me if there is anything that has caused you sorrow or anger. From now on, I shouldn't behave in a manner that angers you. I should behave in a way that makes you happy. Show me your face once again, dear Lord. I should hear your voice. I should feel your presence. He will be merciful to you with everlasting kindness. The Lord who gave his life for you. Will the Lord who loves you more than your father and mother not have mercy on you? Now tell the Lord God, I commit to living a life that doesn't anger you. Father, I was unable to bear you hiding your face from me for a moment. I should see your face, Lord. You should always speak to me. Dear Lord, praise you for being merciful to me with everlasting kindness. Praise you, Lord, for forgiving me. Praise you for enabling me to feel your presence once again. In the name of Lord and Savior Jesus, I pray. Amen. Amen.